Hey, what's going on, everybody? Hope you're doing well on this fine day. Welcome back once again to Kingdom 2 Crown Shogun Mode. We're checking out co-op, and it is episode 24. Uh, do you need more coins? Yeah, I only have one. And you can have that gem bag if you want. <laughs> oh, hey, now I have two. Ooh. You had one in your coin purse. Uh-uh. No, uh, I, I picked up one that you dropped. I only ever had one. No, I, I, I didn't have one. That's weird. Well, now I have two. Huh. I, maybe maybe, <laughs> it, maybe, maybe, maybe it glitched out. That's really weird. <laughs> Yeah, a part of me wants yeah, to. A, two of them in my bag. <laughs> a part of me wants to wait until we <laughs> buy bows for all these guys, but I feel like it's gonna take forever. Oh, it's gonna take so long. It was because we're not generating. Excuse me, enough money. Mm hmm. Look at all that. Oh, yeah. That's what's up. Boo, yeah. All right, I think I'll chop down a couple more trees so we can get closer to this teleporter. probably want that within a wall oh yeah so we don't come out and be surprised <laughs> mm -hmm. uh we're not going to be able to get this inside of a wall for quite a while because we're going to need to uh destroy another portal that's really close to it oh, okay as long as we don't use a uh use the teleporter at night it'll be okay night. yeah I kind of want to empty my coin bag completely just to see if I actually do have two gems. Yeah, right. But at the same time, I don't want to just in case <laughs> I lose the second one. <laughs> yeah. In case it just vanishes. Yeah. I wonder if the dog follows the host or if he just picks someone to follow. Uh, I would assume he probably follows the host. Okay, because he's been following me around. He loves you. Alright, day eight, and I think I can advance the wall a little bit over here, and we'll still be rolling in the Tanuki money. We actually have a pretty significant number of archers. Oh, yeah. Um, what's up? How do we still, how do we still the samurai? I mean, obviously we brought two of them with us, but did we already have someone? Oh, I guess we did. Yeah. Yeah, because I mean, you can only take so many on the boat anyway. Yeah, I think we had more from other islands, but mm -hmm. unless we just left the samurai here when we went back to the first island. Mm, I don't know. I'm not remember. Oh. <gasps> I do have two gems because I accidentally just dropped one. <laughs> That's really weird, but I'm going to take it. I won't complain. Heck yeah, right? <laughs> I'm not going to look that gift towards his mouth. <laughs> Oh yeah, we got a proper army going on. Hell yeah.
I wonder if they um are programmed to favor one side over the other depending on like what side of the mountain's on. Maybe. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I don't want to like I don't want to like diss the devs too much. <laughs> But, like, their games are super buggy, <laughs> so I kind of yeah. doubt it. But you never know. Like, I mean, it's a fun-ass game, but it's got it's got a lot of problems. Uh, yeah. Especially in co-op. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. One teleporter coming up. That archer just stole my coin. Sucker! <gasps> I think I finally run out of people to hire. Nuh uh. Well, no one's running around in camp needing a job. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, there oh, are a ton of guys. Two, here's two people. Three. If only have three people left, that would be a miracle. Oh, hell yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, well, those... I only saw... Three people in the camp, so let right me see on. if the other side has coins. Sweet. I'll feel really accomplished if we actually did that because on this island it kept feeling like we just people just kept showing up. Oh I know, yeah. It's like every time I'd run from side to side, it's just I kept seeing more and more people. Some some new dude, okay. <laughs> Where did you come from? <laughs> Welcome, but where did you come from? These guys are going to be getting so much money now. We need it, so. Oh, yeah. Hooray. And luckily, I was able to expand the wall to a spot that has a uh, archer tower, like, right behind it. Oh, awesome. It's looking like the uh, like the leaves are changing colors. Yeah, I think it's getting ready to be fall. Oh, yeah. Or it is fall. Mm -hmm. Let's see. We're on day... 38? 38. 38. Oh, hell yeah, girl. Uh, we have about... days of fall yeah that should be enough time for us to get a decent amount of money i think mm -hmm. are there any more farming plots anywhere um i haven't seen any okay yeah so i think those were my last three guys because i'm not seeing anyone else that doesn't have a job Rock on. Oh, there's so many archers. This is epic. <laughs> it's 
So I'm kind of worried the game's glitched out and it's not going to build this teleporter because it's been stuck with a wood frame for quite some time now. Have any of the builders come over? Uh uh. No? Nah. Unless they're just running from the right side really far instead of the guys that are right here. I mean, I passed a couple guys on the left side coming back into camp, but they were just standing there. Hmm. Let me come check it out. I'm sad now. <laughs> oh. There is one guy coming over here. Well, oh wait, no he's not. He was just kind of skipping around and being all laggy. Yeah, there's a guy standing right here. Yeah, what a bunch of slackers. There's one on this bridge. Flipping slackers, man. <clears throat> I wish you could build a dungeon and throw them in there. Which teleporter are you talking about? <laughs> Is it not even there? <laughs> well, no, because there's one built. What? Is it, it the one that's right right beyond the oh iron my, thingy? Oh my gosh. Uh, it's the one that's inside of our walls, yeah. It's like it's like right near the, uh, the front line. Okay, because there's one right behind... Right, like right to the left of the iron thing, the iron mine. Uh, yeah, it's it's like I think that's the only one. It's built. No, oh, at least for you it is. Well, yeah, for me. <laughs> it's not for me. No, it's uh, it's stuck at a wood frame for me, and I can't use it. Let me see if I can find two coins. I'll just watch you disappear. <laughs> I was gonna use it earlier, but I didn't think I had any I don't think I had any money. Oh gotcha. Alright, here we go. You're gone. I'm building the other one. Let's see if this one shows up for you. That'd be interesting if it did. Like, I could use it, like, one way. <laughs> yeah. I can see them building it. Well, that's good news at least. Oh, show. Who knows, maybe it'll fix the other one. Well. Yeah, hopefully it will. Ooh. I can see it, but I can't use it. <laughs> oh man. That's so weird. That's all this right. island is just our enemy. Yeah, it it's our is. nemesis. Oh my god. <laughs> this is the final boss. The bane of our existence. <laughs> well, I guess we okay, can start so hiring more guys. Oh. oh. Oh, what's up? I was playing Infinite Warfare. Oh, yeah. Maybe it was, maybe it was Modern Warfare Remastered yesterday with Braden. Mm-hmm. And the account I was playing on was a level one on multiplayer. And he's like a level 50 something. So we were playing against level like 38 and up. Some of them being like in the hundreds. Oh, yeah. But he wanted to play on hardcore mode. Hardcore. So I can't tell you how many games I went oh and whatever. Because I couldn't see anyone to shoot them. Mm hmm. And I was like, everyone's going to get mad at us because I'm dragging the team down. <laughs> <laughs> because I can't kill anyone. Mm -hmm. So then we switched over to Black Ops 3 because I like that multiplayer better anyway. It's more like not monochrome, so you can actually see where people are. Yeah. So we were in hardcore, hardcore mode again, and I actually killed two people and I hadn't died yet. 
But then his mom asked me to move my car so she could get out of the garage. And we got kicked because I was inactive. What? And there, <laughs> there was only one other person on our team, so it was 3v3. <laughs> so, he's like, we were doing so great. He's like, but we got kicked because you weren't you weren't playing. Damn. I was like, you couldn't just move some buttons on my, my yeah. controller. Yeah. yeah, just like twitch it for a second. Yeah. Well, that sucks. And then, and then we were just playing on some like normal, um, I think like, like standard mode or whatever. Mm -hmm. It may have been just me and him with some bots like versus each other. And I was actually doing pretty well after that. Heck yeah. Just, so I'm, you I'm just had the warm better. up. Yeah, I'm getting better. I'm still not doing great. I still wasn't <laughs> positive, but <laughs> <laughs> the last game we played, I was thirty and thirty-seven. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, it's not. It's not like too bad for someone who's not like, you know, like a an avid player or anything. No, and I actually managed to kill him a couple times. Hell yeah. Because um, well, I was kind of screen cheating too. <laughs> <laughs> but he camps in this one building and just it shoots from there, so I always know where he is. <laughs> but I would sometimes just like quick look up at his screen. <laughs> just to make... Yeah, I mean that's just how it goes when you play split screen, you know. Yeah. So <laughs> I was like, well, I'm kind of cheating right now, but mm -hmm. that's what that's what you get if you're gonna camp. <laughs> exactly right. That's just an own. That's just an unspoken rule. Yeah. Whoa, you just came out of nowhere. <laughs> Especially since we were playing on this one really small map, so you kinda you can run from side to side in like a minute. Oh if okay. that like thirty seconds. Mm -hmm. So there's only two there's only two buildings that have second floors that you can even camp in. So it's like I already know where you're gonna be if you're camping, because it's the only place you can go. Right. Yeah, it kind of narrows it down a little bit. <laughs> yeah, so it's not like it's the huge map where there's 8,000 places for you to hide. Yeah. I you heard know, that... I uh, do that in, like, regular games. <laughs> yeah. I heard that uh, in the latest Call of Duty, they're, uh, they're starting to add a bunch of stupid microtransaction stuff, I guess. So, like... Oh, in 4? Yeah, so, like, there's a lot of, like... A lot of YouTubers are, like, making videos about it, and, like, there's a lot of controversy, I guess, because, uh, supposedly, they're charging, like, I think it's, like, two bucks for, like, a, a red dot reticule, or, like, reticle, for, uh, for one of your guns. It's just, like, a, it's just, like, a red dot, you know, it's just, like, a small texture graphic, but they're charging, like, two bucks for it, <laughs> or something like that. Yeah, it's kind of silly. Is there like a way to unlock it within the game or do you like in order to have it you have to buy it um i'm not totally sure i think you have to buy it that's stupid mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah I'm, I'm not really sure how i feel about stuff when it has to do with like the reticule because i mean that's kind of what you use to aim uh -huh. but like on the other hand it's like it's probably not really that big of a deal because it's not like you need it or like it really it's not like it helps you be better at the game it just makes you feel cool so it's it's more just cosmetic than anything, but people are still pretty upset about it. Yeah, I mean the dot can, for me at least, the dot can help. But even like just the having a scope really helps me because just having the iron sights, I'm horrible. Oh yeah, I I am the same way for sure. And for some reason, when we were playing um, Modern Warfare Remastered, it wouldn't let me create my own, like, classes and stuff. So I couldn't customize my weapons. Oh. So I had this... I had, like, three weapon... Um, things that I could choose from, and none of them were customized because for some reason it wouldn't let me do it. And if he did it, it only did it for him. Mm hmm I was like, well, this is dumb. How am I supposed to be able to get any better if you <laughs> won't let me customize my own weapon classes? Right. Black Ops 3 you would, but... <laughs> <laughs> the fog is, like, red. Oh, I don't even see any fog. Or, oh, 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 yeah, I do. 
Yeah, it's like, yeah, it's like a weird red brown color, huh? Yeah, I thought it was like dirt. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> dirt clouds. That that's why I was like, I don't even see any fog, and then I was like, oh wait, yeah, I do. <laughs> it kind of blends in with the uh, uh with the wood wall in the background. Yeah, and it's weird because it's like between the wall and the ground, not like yeah. like in front of it. It's behind it. It's pretty weird. Yeah, we're kind of slowing down with the money, unfortunately, it feels like. Yeah, I think we're getting too far into fall. Um, I've been trying biscuit. to invest in the banker. Ooh, nice. Right on, right on. I'm pretty much, uh, I, th I think I can finally start kind of saving up some money. I'll I was just trying to focus on building up that, uh, that archer tower all the way. Mm-hmm. So now... Well, if you need any money, I have a full bag right now. Oh, no, well, it's good. Well, <laughs> I think I'm pretty good. Okay. We got some floating birds, as usual. No, I don't want the money. Take it back. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of annoying when, whenever you're trying to give him money and he actually gives you money. Well, I saw he was a person and I stopped thinking, oh, hey, he might have money. Mm -hmm. I can take coins from him. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, no, he's the banker. <laughs> so, uh, today's been a pretty busy day in, in regards to, uh, to recording games because, uh, a new Subnautica game came out today. Ooh. Yeah, it's like, uh, it's in early access, so it's like super buggy and like it runs like sh <laughs> <laughs> but uh it's it, it's pretty fun so far um is that the one you were talking about in your last um solo video uh i don't know i don't think i mentioned it i think i only found out about it a couple days ago okay because you said something about so unless it was you said they were doing like a major subnautica update or something or recording again. maybe i did mention that i don't know I, I know I know I was talking about just playing uh playing the regular Subnautica game. That might have been what it was. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'll uh, admit I wasn't paying hundred percent full attention to the video. <laughs> How dare you? I demand one hundred percent attention. <laughs> no, yeah, it's uh it's a it's a pretty cool it, well it's not a DLC, it's like a full game. It costs twenty bucks. Or is it twenty I think it's twenty five bucks. And uh it's basically following following the same like development formula as the first one so it's in early access and they're going to be updating the game like periodically mm -hmm. uh it, it basically takes place on the same planet but it's like some some time in the future i guess after the first game and you're on like the north pole so like it's all everything's all frozen hmm. and it's like really cold and stuff that should be pretty cool yeah it's it's pretty fun so far but yeah, it sucks because like there's a there's a really cool area in the game right now, but anytime I go in it, the game just lags like flipping crazy. Oh. So, that's not fun. Yeah. I mean it doesn't really bother me all that much, but like I know it's gonna bug people when they try watching the video. <laughs> and there's mm -hmm. nothing I can do about it. But that's exactly oh. how uh, how the first game was. Like during during the early days of the first game, it was it ran so poorly. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm upgrading this outer wall to the metal before we <gasps> go in. What? My hero. <laughs> oh, so before we go and attack the portal. Heck yeah. Good call, good call. Well, I had this full sack of money, and instead I'm just running back and forth without anything to do. Mm -hmm. Decided maybe I should do something. <laughs> Hell yeah, good call, girl. Because there's no one left for me to hire. Yeah, so. <laughs> I, I'm still surprised about that. You were you were on top of that crap. Yeah, I don't know how that happened. <laughs> I'm gonna unlock the boat. Sounds good. Sounds good. So, um, actually, the mountain portal's on the right side. What? Cracker, please. <laughs> and that's actually... Well, I figured it would be, but that's how exactly how it was for the... The 
island when we were here the first time. Oh, yeah. Oh, these guys are actually getting a decent amount of money still from the, the Tanuki. Yeah, I was just standing there while they were building the wall and they just kept giving me money. <laughs> Hell yeah. So yeah, I'm hoping, uh, well, I'm, I'm not hoping, I'm thinking, well, I kind of am hoping, uh, <laughs> like later today, <laughs> probably like late at night, I'm probably going to try editing up the first couple videos for Subnautica, and I think I'm going to try editing them a little bit more than I usually do, because there's a couple, like, every now and again in that game, it can be kind of grindy, just kind of like boring, mm -hmm. so I'll, I'll probably try doing like nice transitions and stuff like that. So we'll see, maybe... That'll be nice. Yeah. Ho ho hopefully it'll come out well. <laughs> <laughs> My brother asked me the other day if I wanted him to try and help set me up for capture in case oh, yeah. he wanted my footage, and I was like, yeah, I don't think he wants to see my footage. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it could be kind of cool every once in a while. <laughs> it's like, it would be just a lot of the same thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if we were, like, yeah, I mean, it, it just kind of depends on the game, really. Yeah. Yeah. Like, and Brayden was like, why don't you stream it? I was like, no one would watch me stream. <laughs> <laughs> you never know. Yeah. You, know, <laughs> you could, um, you could just trick people. You could just, you could just put up a, a still image, like where your webcam would be of like some supermodel. <laughs> and then people, you, you, you'll probably get like a million viewers in no time. <laughs> Um, I want to say it's Black Ops 4 mm -hmm. from his PlayStation, and he posted about it on Facebook the other day, so I was like, oh, hey, let me go watch it. Um, so I started watching it, but I had to have the sound on mute because I wasn't at home. I was at a friend's house. Oh, gotcha. And I didn't want to be rude. <laughs> mm -hmm. So I was like, hey, I told him, I was like, hey, I'm watching your stream. And he's like, oh, are you really? I was like, yeah. So I think I was his only viewer. Um, but I was like, I gave you a follow. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. I think I'm his only follower right now. <laughs> Gotta start somewhere. <laughs> and I was watching it again the other night and I fell asleep. <laughs> <laughs> I think the most viewers I've ever had, I mean, I don't stream very often as, as I'm sure you know, but, uh, I think the most viewers I ever had was maybe like 17 or something like that. Wow. Yeah. I know, I'm a big shot. Do you remember, shot. What, you were, do you remember <laughs> what you were playing? Uh, I don't remember. I want Maybe it was Prey? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Probably. That was a pretty fun game. Uh, my brother told me that, like, every time you play the game, it's, like, drastically different, I guess. Even though I've only played through it once, so I, I, I don't really know. <laughs> I downloaded it for Game Pass for my Xbox, um, and I just haven't played it yet. Oh, yeah. Because I'm still trying to beat the campaign for Black Ops 4. Oh, gotcha. Or 3. Black Ops 3. Um, and I honestly haven't been playing the Xbox as much. Because I had it hooked up to my computer, so my dad could, like, watch TV mm -hmm. while I was playing, but... I moved it back out into the living room so Brayden and I could play it on the comfy couch. Hell yeah. And I just haven't moved it back, so I haven't really been playing it as much. Gotcha. Yeah, ever since I got a PC, I just kind of don't really play consoles all that much anymore. Well, it was nice having it on my computer because it, at least... The screen is obviously smaller than a normal TV, but I sit closer to it. So yeah, the so it's like look better. Exactly. And I can see things better. Mm. But it's not fun to sit on. Well, my my desk is technically a dining room table. Oh yeah. So the chairs gotcha. aren't the comfiest. Yeah, I, I feel you. I feel like I want to get one of those like uh, those desks that transition from like sitting to standing because 
you know, I spend like a lot of time on the computer and like my back sometimes or like my neck will start to hurt. Oh, yeah. Because like I, I try to maintain my posture, you know, all the time. But sometimes, uh, I don't know, sometimes I just end up leaning in, you know, <laughs> mm -hmm. and then my neck starts to kill me. I was actually just sitting here thinking that maybe I should get a mini couch. Well, I guess it would be a chair, an mm -hmm. armchair or something. So I can at least play games in comfort, but... Exactly, right? What size, uh, uh, what size monitor do you have? That's a good question, I don't know. <laughs> um, it's an Asus, that's all I know. Mm. Um, my brother bought it for me, let me ask him. I want to say it's like a, it's like the size of a small TV, so it's probably like a 24 inch. Oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah, that's pretty, uh, that's pretty good size. That's pretty, like, standard these days. I think that's what mine is. Well, peeps, that's going to be it for this episode once again. As always, if you enjoyed, hit that thumbs up. That would be super awesome. Subscribe if you are not already, and we will see you guys in the next one.